What's up guys, it is ExtremeFs here, and today I'm going to be sort of reviewing an app called iFile. It is a city application, and it was my, one of my subscribers that told me to make more advanced videos. He's called, he's called Peter Bread Peter. link in the video description to his channel. And, of course, as always, I am listening to my subscribers, so I decided to make this video. So, um, iFile is pretty much like the Finder app on the Mac, uh, on the Mac computer, and there has been a previous version of this called Mobile Finder, but then as the 3.0 firmware released, there came, uh, it came out a new version called iFile, and you have to pay for it, or you don't have to pay for it, but um, it is available from the big bus stores, and you have to pay for it, but if you add the source I am posting in the video description, it's called the Sinful iPhone Repo, um, <clears throat> uh, that is a source with a lot of cracked apps. You can check out my review of it. Uh, you, you just go to my channel and search for the video, Best City App Sources there will be. So yeah, there it is. <clears throat> it is cracked and free. So what this allows you to do, it allows you to access all your files on your iPhone. So I'm just going to give an example. Uh, if you want to check out your themes, go to, uh, go, um, to as far as you can, as far, as far back as you can, and then scroll down to var uh, scroll down to var sorry um, choose stash and then go to themes and here are all your themes I have quite many themes because I am a theme viewer on my other channel and why would you want to do this um, this is so that you sort of can switch the images between the theme. So there is a theme called Alias Tag Theme. If I go to it and check it out, I can now see the lock background, for example, and this is what it looks like. Now let's see, I don't like the lock background, or I do, but I sort of don't want it. Then just go to, go back and click Edit and choose that one and you can delete it and so that is what you that is the main feature I use in the iFile application and I will keep this quite so short because my camera is running out of battery power so that is what you can that is one thing you can do and you can also access your applications by obviously going to the applications folder and here are all your applications except the apps or apps and here you can make some customization as well like uh, changing the system strings if I go to uh, let's just take the settings app okay it wasn't actually here and by the way um, the, some of the applications are, is renamed here so the mail is mobile mail, the safari is web but <clears throat> um, if you just want to change the icon on one app like make it mine you can just click edit choose this one and you can copy it or you can create a, a zip file but you can copy it or cut it, whatever you want, and let's say I want to cut this and set it as an icon on another application let's say I want to set it as the icon on the iFile application then I just choose icon right here, click edit and delete that as well delete that and now paste the other icon and then when you go back to your home screen respring your, de your device or reboot. I'm just going to do that. And now after rebooting my device you can see that my iFile 
icon has changed to the make it mine icon. So, as I said, I gotta keep this short because my camera is running out of battery power and I wanna make this video now. I don't wanna wait because, yeah, whatever. I wanna upload it. I think it's fun. So, yeah, it's a lot fun to play around with it. Maybe you won't be as um, good at the beginning, but you will learn. I have learned, and you can also change the images on um, if you like, if you're playing um, iCopter for an example, you can change the iCopter to, to the Zidia icon if you want to. So you can do all that kind of stuff and you can also make some, you can change your system strings. So it is very fun to play around with. I'm going to give a shout out to Peter Bird Peter for, uh, for wanting me to make this tutorial or app review or whatever you want to call it. So go ahead, check out his channel. So thanks for watching. Please subscribe, follow me on Twitter, and I will see you in the next video.